The most complex problems in our time can be solved with simple techniques if we are able to dream. As a child, I discovered that creativity is the key to cross from dreams to reality. I learned this from my grandmother, Dr. Ruth Thihawa, a Jewish refugee that settled in the heart of the Andes. That is how I grew up, encouraged to see beyond any limitation. So part of my education included helping her in remote indigenous communities. I cherish those memories because they helped me to understand the life outside the city, a life with a lot of possibilities, without barriers as language or culture. During those trips, my grandmother used to recite a Kipling poem, something hidden. Go and find it. Go and look behind the mountains. Something lost behind the mountains, lost and waiting for you. Go. In the coming years, I became a medical student. One of every hundred children born worldwide has some kind of heart disease. There is a part of this problem. I think I can solve this part of this problem. I have spent my life, my life working on. The problem starts during pregnancy. The fetus needs to survive inside the mother. The survival depends on communications between the systemic and the pulmonary blood. At the moment of birth. This communication needs to stop. If it doesn't close, the baby has a hole in the heart. It is caused by prematurity and genetic conditions. But what we know today is the lack of oxygen. It also is one of the causes. As you can see in the chart, the frequency. Of、uh, this kind of hole dramatically increase with the altitude. When you look patients with these conditions, they seem desperate to breathe. To close the hole, major surgery used to be the only solution. One night, my friend Malte and I we were camping in the Amazon region. The only thing that not burned in the fire was a green avocado branch. There came a moment of inspiration, so we used the branch as a mold for our first invention. The hole in children's heart can be closed with it. A coil is a piece of wire wrapped onto itself. It maybe don't look so fancy to you now, but that was our first successful attempt. To create a device for this major problem. In this video, we can see how a very tiny catheter takes the coil to the heart. The coil then closes the hole. After that moment of inspiration, there came a long, a very long, time of effort. Developing a prototype in vitro and vivo studies took thousands of hours in the lab in work. The coil, if it works, can save lives. I returned from Germany to Bolivia, thinking that wherever we go, we have the opportunity to make a difference. With my wife and partner, Dr. Alexandra Heat, we started to see patient. After successful treating patient with our coil, we felt really enthusiastic. But we live. In a place that is 12,000 feet high, and the patients there, they need a special device to solve their heart condition. The hole in altitude patients is different because the orifice between the arteries is larger. Most patients cannot afford to be treated on time, and they die. 
the first coin could successfully treat only the half of the patients in Bolivia. The search started again. We went back to the drawing board. After many trials, and with the help of my grandmother's indigenous friends in the mountains, we obtained a new device. For centuries, indigenous women told stories by weaving complex patterns on looms. An unexpected skill helped us for the new device. We take this traditional method to weaving and make a design made by a smart material that records the shape. It seems the time the weaving allows us to create seamless device that not rust because it's made of only one piece. This can shape by itself into a very complex structures by a procedure. That took decades to develop. As you can see, the device enters the body through the natural channels. Doctors have only to cross the catheter through the hole. Our device expands, places itself, and closes the hole. We have this beautiful delivery system that is so simple to use because it works by itself. No open surgery. Was necessary. As doctors, we fight with diseases that takes a long time and effort to heal. If they do, this is the child from before, after the procedure. As you can see. As you can see, once the device is in place, the patient is 100% healed. From the start to the finish, the whole procedure takes only 30 minutes. That's very rewarding from the medical and human point of view. We are so proud that some of our former patients are part of our team. A team. Thanks to the close interaction with patients that works with us, together we have only one idea: that the best solutions needs to be simple. We lost the fear to creating something new. The path it's not easy. Many obstacles arise all the time, but we receive the strength from our patients. Their resilience. And courage inspire our creativity. Our goal is to make sure that no child is left behind, not because of cost or access. So we have to step a foundation with one-to-one -one model. We will give one device for free to make sure that every child. Is treated. We are in many countries now, but we need to be everywhere. And this whole thing began with one impossible idea, as will continue truly.、Really. No child is left behind. Muchas gracias.